Okay, guys, here we are. This is my first mod video. Uh, Vault 88 video with a little bit of uh, the construction um, progress. So, this is the front door. Which is all standard. This is all pre existing. Um, so, however, I have started running power through, um, through all the walls from the standard reactor, which is here. And the power actually travels up through the wall here. And goes up to that point, and then through the wall, and down into the main building area. Not complete, I see, but there would be an elevator on the side. And this is the main uh, vault atrium uh, with the tunnels off to the north sector, the northeast sector, and the east sector, and the unused railway tunnels over that way. Um, the only thing wall. better than getting pissed is taking a fight. Am I right? Up the stairs. Another level is not there yet. On this level, we just have some windows. My plan is to actually build a garden in there. I'll leave the plants. But there will be, this will be the level that will have a bridge that runs out across the atrium. It's mirror image, so both sides are the same. So Push Clem to the limit. The power this is the overseer's deck. Once again, sort of very imaged. You pass through this doorway, which is open currently. You'll be able to see the garden just below. And you head up the stairs through another doorway that's already open into the overseer's office, which uh, is quite, quite well lit. Nice little waiting area. When you're waiting to see the ads here, a uh, display of uniforms. Same thing on this side. Unfortunately, though, because of the shape of the buildable area, um, I couldn't run up the floor right across because it ran into this wall. So, that's it so far. Not much, I know, it doesn't look like much, but uh, we can do each inside panel, outside panel, floor, ceiling panels, and so on. It becomes a bit more complicated. I'll show you behind the scenes. So this is where my power comes in from the reactor. I've got one that runs around, so a beacon, a beacon and it powers the lift. And then the other one runs all the way up the wall and up around the top. So that wiring there goes off and lights my path around to see the areas here. And um, then we've got a service. This will be blocked off eventually, you won't be able to see it. So we've got a little service stairway here. And uh, you can use this just to climb up on top of the overseer's office. You can see up here what the power setup, all the uh, all the different uh, conduits and uh, so on around the place that enable all these lights to light up. So I guess the final thing to show you is what it looks like. taking quite a while to do and uh, keep changing between using mid sections and roof sections and so on to try and get the ceiling to play right. Uh, originally I did these side ceiling bits and they were a level higher and they actually cut into the roof. So I had to bring them back down and then work around them. But um, 
as you can tell, the lighting is probably the hardest, hardest thing to get right. So, I'm actually back caravan and stuff here. Pretty retired, and I'm just using those tunnels as a farm, but the actual atrium itself will come across. That will just be a separate sort of section. So, there you go, my first little video. But, uh, I'm liking where it's going so far, it's looking quite good.